Welcome back to our Father's Day edition of Champion News Talk Radio, brought to you by championnews.net. Our founder, Jack Roser, and myself, Carol Parisi, are speaking with Jerry McDaniel, The Philosophy of Evil. Jerry, where can our listeners get your book? Do you have a website? Tell us a little bit about your website and anything else that um, our listeners would find to be valuable. Okay, shortly the book hopefully is going to be um, published or republished by a national publisher. But I don't have any contracts signed yet, so mm -hmm. uh, I can't give you that. Right now it's only available on my website, which is illinoisconservative.com. Illinoisconservative.com. Okay. And they can go there, they'll find uh, uh, the table of contents and a list of uh, the subject index, so mm -hmm. they can tell what, what the book is about. <clears throat> the okay. full title is Philosophy of Evil, Socialism in America. So, it, yeah, the Philosophy of Evil is a clever title. It yeah. describes socialism. Yeah. But what it's about is socialism in America. It, it traces the socialism from the uh, early 1800s, well, actually from 1607, uh, 1620. Both yeah. the, the Jamestown colony and the uh, <coughs> uh, pilgrims practiced socialism as their economic uh, system initially. You know, uh, so it I've, didn't work. I've, I've listened to you be, uh, between segments here and looked at your book a bit. And uh, I, I'd like to, you know, say that uh, you've got an interesting book here. Anybody that thinks that you're just uh, stirring up the, in a dusty old document here and giving us things that we uh, think we know all about this thing, uh, you've got a lot to say that's very fundamental, very interesting to me uh, about what the people said and did. That's a lot different than we uh, have any idea about uh, what it was and how we got misled so much into where we are now. Uh, this is a terrific book, Jerry. Yeah. Jerry, it's the, interesting. How can um, the folks benefit from this book, and what do you think they will learn from your book? And will it help them restore America? Well, I tried to give it a historical reference without being, without sounding like a history professor. Mm, that's good. Um, <laughs> it's written in common language, but it covers all the historical topics. In other words, where did communism start? Well, I mean, where did socialism start? Mm -hmm. How did it get a foothold in America? Mm -hmm. how, did it, how did it go from what it was in 1880 to what it is in 2011? Yeah. Is, are there solutions, actionable solutions, that our listeners can take in your book that can help them learn to take back America? Well, as far as what the uh, American people can do to take back America is vote the socialist or the progressives out of office and replace them with conservatives. That's the only thing they can do. Other than that, the... Um, history will probably repeat itself. Uh, I would estimate that the, or I would uh, prophesy that the Democratic Party will either be, become the only party in America ruled by a, a leader, in other words, it'll be an oligarchy ruled by a socialist leader, uh, whoever it would be, either that or the, or the Democratic Party will completely destroy itself in the next two elections. Um, that, that's what happened in 1800. History does repeat itself. It huh? always repeats itself. We're, we're a rambunctious people and could well muddle through and forge out uh, something practical. Uh, I, I just refuse to believe that we can be beat back and uh, be socialism under an a arrogant uh, con man like Obama. You know, we have an election coming up. Get Philosophy of Evil by Jerry, and you can go to his website. And this is going to wrap up another great edition of Champion News Talk Radio, brought to you by championnews.net. Be sure to catch us every Sunday at 8 a.m. on AM 560 WIND. This is Carol Parisi and Jack Roser saying thank you and happy Father's Day from Champion News Talk Radio. Your choice for the conservative voice, make it a great week.